So Jim, caffeine, super popular in today's society. Uh, what did Dr. B say about caffeine? Is, um, caffeine, number one, is a diuretic, he says. It wipes out your vitamins, your minerals, electrolytes. Big word, it negates them. According to Dr. Mendel's New Vitamin Bible, page 436, it wipes out your B vitamins. B1, B2, B6, B12, zinc, potassium, vitamin C. And zinc is one thing that's critical to the body because it's what holds your DNA together. Zinc is important for communication on the cells. It's also important for healing. But when I say it holds your DNA together, I mean it's pretty critical. As Dr. B states in his book, you've got a zinc finger, a zinc twist, and a zinc cluster. So when you start messing with zinc at the DNA level, it's not very good at all. Caffeine, all caffeine does is stimulate the adrenal glands that sit over your kidneys. It tells the liver give up its stored sugar called glycogen. As soon as it gives up its sugar, then the body cannibalizes off itself to put another load of sugar back into the liver to react to another emergency. So if you keep taking caffeine, you end up with an adrenal exhaustion. There's, there's a limit to what you can do. He explains when you take this, this sugar is dumped into the bloodstream that you think clearer, that your brain feels better, but you don't understand that it's cannibalizing. You could take orange juice, just sugar, and put it in the water and take it, or, or take some kind of a lifesaver, real sugar, and start sucking on it. You're going to get the same effect that you get from that. And unfortunately, they have these energy drinks that you can take. I won't name any of them, but you can take these things. And there's no caffeine. It says no caffeine. No, it's a synthetic chemical that stimulates the adrenal glands that causes the liver to give up its stored sugar. There's no free ride. You're not going to be able to take some drug and you got energy from it. The energy comes from your body. So if you keep taking this stuff down the road, you're going to have some major problems because the body can't keep giving this stuff up as it keeps compromising itself. Down the road, you're going to have all these crapola labels we put on diseases, which is nothing more than that the body is out of balance. It's dehydrated. It's lacking water, salt, and amino acids.